Hey guys, it's Jano Heat here. How's everyone doing today? So, for today's video, we're going to be doing a little bit of a shorter video today, but I wanted to show you guys something really cool in Halo 3, and that is the rarest nameplate in Halo 3. Now, this nameplate, I actually did not know about until, like, quite recently. That's, that's how rare it is. Like, I've played Halo 3 for, like, over 10 years now. Um, almost 12 years, actually. And I never knew about this nameplate. Uh, so for those of you who don't know, Halo 3 actually did have nameplates. Um, now, if you uh, played Halo 3, if you started playing Halo 3 for the first time in, like, the past few years, then you probably never knew about the nameplates because you can't change nameplates anymore. But it did have a few nameplates. Not as many as, like, MCC or Halo 5. Um, nowhere near, in fact, but it did have a few, and there used to be a way you could change your nameplates. So, let's take a look at some of the nameplates first. The first one is this little bungee symbol nameplate, uh, the seventh column nameplate. Uh, you get that for, for linking your gamer tag to your bungee.net profile, and that's like the most common nameplate, aside from the default nameplate, which is, you know, nothing. But, if you play Halo 3 on a 360 or the backwards compatible version on Xbox One, if you play online, you'll probably still come across people with that nameplate. The next nameplate is the Bungie nameplate. This one was definitely pretty rare back in the day, because, you know, it was only for Bungie employees, not surprisingly. And it was never permanently given to anybody uh, for extended periods of time, like it was in Halo Reach. In Halo Reach, the Bungie nameplate was actually given out to everybody during Bungie Day, uh, way back. I don't remember the exact year, uh, but it, you know, it was given out to everybody, including the uh, Blue Flame helmet. But on Halo 3, it was never given out to everybody permanently, so the Bungie nameplate, unfortunately, is, uh, you know, it was it's not available to most people still. But the 7th column one is available to, to most people. But the rarest nameplate actually is the Pro nameplate. And, yeah, that that's the nameplate. And I actually never knew it existed until quite recently, and that's because only one person in the entire world has it. And that person's gamer tag is Lewis Wu. He's also known as Claude Herrera. Now, that may sound familiar to you because Herrera is actually, um, his name was used as an Easter egg in Halo Reach as well for the Club Herrera Easter egg. So, who is this person? Well, he was the founder and creator of Halo.Bungie.org, which was pretty much the first and the largest Halo fan site. Uh, and he was basically, uh, pillar of the community back then and thus Bungie rewarded him with the pro nameplate the most exclusive nameplate possible now uh, ever since like Bungie broke off their partnership with Microsoft and their Bungie on website was disconnected from um, Halo 3 people are no longer able to change nameplates anymore so pretty much every nameplate is pretty rare now but the pro nameplate still rem remains the rarest and as you can see it's, a, it's actually a pretty cool nameplate and you know, there's, it literally is one of a kind. There is no way you can unlock this nameplate. Not that there ever was any way to begin with, unless you're um, Louis Wu or uh, Claude Herrera. But the only way I have it here is because I did a little simple main menu mod on my Mod 360 um, on an offline profile. And that's how I can show you guys what it's like um, in, in action. But yeah, so there you guys have it. That is the rarest nameplate in all of Halo 3 and probably the rarest nameplate in all of Halo, actually, because there's only one person that has it, um, officially. But yeah, so hopefully you guys found this to be interesting, and if you did enjoy this video, as always, you know, make sure to leave a like, uh, leave your thoughts and comments, just anything you want me to check out or look into, you know, just let me know, and I'll do my best to get around to it. Uh, but other than that, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.